everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make this Hogwarts house points counter. I'll list all the materials you'll need to make this down below in the description box. So let's get started. First I printed and cut it out these Hogwarts house crests, I'll leave a link to the ones that I used down below in the description box. Then I found these corked bottles at my local craft store. You can use hourglass bottles if you want to, or smaller bottles if you want to make this into a necklace or something. I'll be using red, yellow, blue, and green sand to fill up my corked bottles, but you can also use small beads if you want to. You'll also need some packing tape. So then I took a piece of packing tape and got one of my crests and placed it into the middle of that piece of packing tape. Then I used my scissors to trim the tape a little bit. By the way, you don't have to add the crest to the bottles, I just thought it'd make a nice touch. Then I took a corked bottle and placed the taped crest into the middle of the corked bottle. And obviously you're going to repeat this step with each of the houses. Then I'm taking a bit of paper and rolling it into a cone-like shape to make a funnel. Once I got it to that cone shape, I took a piece of tape and taped it so it wouldn't come apart. I made this funnel so it'd be easier to pour the sand into the corked bottle. So since I'm a Slytherin, I'm a little biased and I'm going to make Slytherin house in the lead in the house cup because I can and I will and I'm going to fill up that corked bottle all the way to the top with green sand. And close behind is Gryffindor house and I filled it up a little bit below Slytherin house with red sand. This part is obviously up to you. You can decide who do you want in the lead in the house cup. Who do you want in second place, third place, fourth place? Again, it's up to you. But it is absolutely mandatory that Slytherin House is not in last place. I'm watching you. Slytherin House, my house, better be second place or higher. Okay? Okay, I'm watching you. But yeah, I'm totally sorry if I put your house in second, third, or fourth. I chose Ravenclaw as third place and Hufflepuff as fourth place. I'm so sorry. But don't you worry, Hufflepuff, you got your revenge on me because out of all the sand that I opened, your jar of yellow sand exploded everywhere when it opened. So if you're wondering where your house points went, it went all over my bed, my mat, my floor, just freaking everywhere. So the video was going to end here, but I didn't really like the cork color, so I got green, red, blue, and yellow acrylic paint and painted the corks. Obviously, I chose these colors to match the sand, so it's kind of like sand waiting to be dropped into the bottles, if you get what I'm saying. I hope that makes sense. Anyways, I painted each of the corks in each of the colors, and once they dried, I popped it back onto the bottles. So yeah, that's it. Let me know in the comments below who you'd put in first, second, third, and fourth in the Hogwarts House Cup. I hope you guys liked this video, and if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you give this DIY a try and want to show me, post your pictures on Instagram with the hashtag PotterThings so I can see. Also, it means so much to me if you subscribe to my channel for more DIYs and future videos, and thanks so much for watching.